What's up guys? Um, this probably was a bad idea. Yeah, so I bought it like that. I wanted to clean it because you can see how dirty it looks, right? So as I went deeper and deeper unscrewing everything, I'm like, probably I should have washed it as a whole, not separately. So um going to, regardless i'm going to clean it right now we'll see what happens when i'm putting it back together if it, if it goes back exactly the way it was or i'll just regret this all right let's do this <laughs> cover basically as you guys can see as I said, it was pretty dusty dirty a uh, bit looking rustish some places and that's why I wanted to get it cleaned this is where our babies will have to sit but as you can see it had gone a bit of mold right and to my thinking I'm like I want to rather soak the whole thing and clean it all again and uh, get it there as I said, it was probably a bad idea for me to take it apart, but you know what? That ship sails, so it's taken apart, so now I'm going to wash it. So I have a big, you know, water here. I'm just going to put in some soap and then get washing. I'm using laundry soap. I'll be using a brush. I have a bit of a cloth here too, in case I need to. I'm just going to drop everything in. It's basically in three pieces. Are you going to help? Hmm? Are you going to help me wash it, Liam? Help me wash them. Mm So it was pretty dirty because I've just taken everything out right now on the side. I'm going to rinse it, but as you can see that water, right? It was definitely dirty, so it's time to rinse. Just wait for it to dry up. The moment I've been dreading, and you guys have been waiting for me. Guess. So I need to put this back together.
all right so basically all done i think i would say one as you can clearly see everything is here the wheels are on i've put everything in maybe uh you know when you're putting something together that because i refuse to look for instructions so that simply means you'll have some leftover stuff so this is what i have right i have some washers those i'm gonna put on because they're easy i mean you just take something on just put the, the washers on for more tightness really make them more tight um other than that i think i did a pretty good job uh, considering that i put it apart and i, I didn't have a manual man to put it back together and as you can see it's pretty clean for sure because uh, i wanted to make sure it was nice and clean who needs a manual right guys anyway um that's it guys um i'm going to leave i'm going to show you every single part right now basically as you guys can clearly see every single part that you have to put back together and uh, i didn't do it by myself i had a helper here yeah i've been here with heather heather's been helping right heather right right yeah we've done it me and heather while well, is sleeping mommy and uh, auntie went for a little outing for themselves daddy here taking care of the babies while i do what i need to get to do that and that reminds me guys about the lady okay um uh, every now and then take you take your take over the kids so that they she can have a time out from the babies i do that every now and then right heather <sighs> all right guys make sure you like share subscribe so you never miss a bite as usual of course i do other videos mainly cooking so if you guys want to check those out that'd be great uh well look around you what do you think do you like any of that well give it a try anyways guys i also do a word of the day and Heather looks pretty tired right now. I think I'm gonna have to give a bottle. Um, the word of the day today, we're gonna go with baby. Baby. In my language, we say, Omwana. Omwana is a baby. And as you can see, I'll give you two words today. It also has toys here. Um, as you can see clearly. Toys, we all, something you play with, we say, Chakuzanisa. I know, it's a mouth. Cha kuzanyisa is toy or toys. Ebyo kuzanyisa is many. Cha kuzanyisa is a toy as something you used to play with. Heather, signing out. Say, say bye. Don't laugh, just say bye. Say bye. Say bye. <laughs> That's what she said. have screws right there just here where the seats are something holds one here another one on that side same thing on the other side one here one there these screws you see here those are for the bricks be the same thing on the other side there but you also have this which you saw me put on earlier which holds the tire here. Those screws go to the back. You may not see them right now hiding over there. Now at the back here, you do have these little, um, I guess, brackets or washers or something. They're rubber, which you put in between here because that's where you pull. To make sure that it's nice and tight. I need to tighten this one here. So that is right there. And then this goes in and out. That'll be your handle come out if you push that to come out so sometimes this, this is attached on a bike i'm just gonna use it mainly for running my kits as you can see the reflectors you have on there if you are riding the bike um uh, so you have this bar which has to go across way inside so this here helps you have this standing up or you can break it down how do you do it so there's a little nudge here because i took this off also is one two three four it also has something to hold it here this one in order to pull this out you just basically take that out like that same thing on the other side like that 
and this holds this tot. So basically once you take that out like this, which is pretty tight, like that, and you take the handles out like that, this helps you to actually so that you can fit this in proper in your car. So that will fall down, that will fall down, and actually put this inside, sorry. So that way becomes a lot easier for you to actually um, make sure this fits in your car. Because now it's compact, right? Um, uh, now there's a difference definitely between what you see right there, right? It becomes a lot easier. So yes, you don't have to take the tires off. Now let's put back together. Either are you enjoying your bottle? Good girl. So then here, just pull this back up like this. You bring this back up here and then just slide right in into the slot. You do have to really pull it in order to get this here. That folds right in like that. So push that all the way. Same thing on the other side. Oh, it can't by the go in unless if you hold this. Unless if you push on this button right here. So you have to push that button in order for this to go in because it's going to help you lock it. Now that's all the way in. Now you can actually put your cover on if you want. Now you can actually put this back on here like that. Same on this side. Provided you push this in. That should click in just fine. 